McLeod on there for his appreciation. Well taken. Welcome to Retro Football TV. In honour of PES 2017 and FIFA 17 being released, we are going to play every single ISS PES versus every single FIFA game through every single year that they've come out. We're going back in time 20 years this week. ISS 64 versus FIFA 64. Originally released in December 1996 in Japan under the title of GQ World Soccer 3. ISS 64 or International Superstar Soccer 64 if you don't like brevity came out in Europe in June of 1997. Official Nintendo Magazine ranked it 81st in the top 100 of all Nintendo games and it received a 9 out of 10 vote from IGN.com. FIFA 64 aka the forgotten FIFA title, so forgotten that it doesn't even have its own entry on Wikipedia, it's, it's just in the other games bit of the FIFA series. It received a 4.2 rating from IGN.com. It's perhaps most famous for featuring in our worst FIFA cover stars of all time video as a regional variation of Jordi Cruyff on the cover. And it had motion capture from David Ginola, which FIFA 97 also had, which also came out around that time and was, was probably a little bit better. And it's equally, um, it's much better known. So, which is going to come out on top? Will it be ISS 64? Will it be FIFA 64? Let's find out. International Superstar Soccer. Oh, fuck, I thought he was one of ours. Yeah, I genuinely did. I genuinely did as well. Yeah! yeah. Oh, best. <laughs> <new. laughs> Score! No! <laughs> the pad's fine for me. It's just... Oh, it's me partner. <laughs> it's not even that. Like I can't. Yeah. I can't tap. I can't find a man. Yeah. Is my problem. I, you know. I think you're probably in the same boat as well. I just. Uh, yeah. <gasps> oh, he's in again. What's the keeper doing? Yes. How many times have you played this in this week leading up to this pool? I don't think I've. Yeah. None. But it was plugged in, oh, and yeah. it was on. <laughs> I've spent thousands of hours playing this game. <laughs> That's the worrying thing about it. Oh, oh Bray. <laughs> <laughs> Keep us really sore there. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Just having a word. Puffed his chest out. Puffed, puffed his chest puffed out. His and then. Gives me a look. Look, he's got a green pen. In fact, I've missed more shots than him by a mile. Oh, well, then. Let me snap. Well, you punched him, lad, over and left. <laughs> Get in! Oh, boys. That is. Thousands of hours. <laughs> Game's in a bag. Responsive as a potato when you tap it. What the? Oh, Do you still? Do you still? Do yourself, lad. I don't feel comfortable with this. Sting. In your face, mate! In your. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Aubrey. I mean, that had nothing to do with me. <laughs> <laughs> How did FIFA come to take over the world in football games after this? Tosh. Yeah. Oh, what's the Keep it doing. <laughs> well, I feel like there might be a little bit of a gap there for me. Yeah, that's where Gaza would be. Well, in lad. <laughs> <laughs> so the arrow was nowhere near there. <laughs> no, it was literally nowhere near there. The arrow was the, the other side, side of the goal. goal. This is going to be the worst oh football God. games what the f ever like? been. Did you see it? <laughs> right, okay, gents. That was a fun, judging by the clothes, week of our lives. <laughs> I was playing those two games. No, it wasn't. So what we're going to do is we're going to rate the two titles. We've got eight categories. We're going to break it down. There's a simple winner, one or one or two there, and we'll decide at the end what the total score is. I feel that you know we've, we've kicked this off with one that could be 
could decide it quite easily. Yeah. Um, if I'm perfectly honest, um, throughout this series, though, we're going to do every single every single iteration of these games, and we'll have a leaderboard, and we'll we'll know which is the best game in total. First and foremost, though, that's twenty years old. Both of these games. Does that make you feel ludicrously yeah, old for really. a start? I never played these actually. Yeah. I never had an N six four. I kind of thousands of hours. <laughs> <laughs> I struggled. I was by far the worst player on these because I had never used an N sixty four pad before. Yeah. So I had to get get to grips with all that. No, I'll hold that up. If you if <laughs> if you if yeah. I'd have had a PlayStation, people can already have tol told. If I'd have had a PlayStation pad to play this, you know, if it wouldn't it, have worked because I'm used to that. Because it's not. I know it's not. But I'm saying <laughs> I would have been better. Right? Or if I'd have had residual. Thousands of hours of using you could have been just as bad as me. Yeah, but fantastic. At least, because <laughs> if anyone's watched the clips, there's so many times I'm at the back just looking at the pad, which you can never do a fast pace, fast paced game doing, can you? Yeah. But that being said, I remember them existing, and I don't think it was 20 years ago. I think someone's lying to us. So licenses. Um, Clear. Let's it. not even let's not even mess about. And and this is this is going to be again one consistent theme. And this is the struggle that ISS and Pez is going to face, I think, throughout this entire series. It's going to start every single episode. One down. One nil down. Because it's never had like it's never had better licenses. Yeah. The thing is, for me, it doesn't it didn't go out of date because the players they that, that's the thing, they don't. They don't. It doesn't yeah. matter. If it's a good football game, it's a good football game. I played it with my brother all the time. Like You've got you, it's the like it's the likenesses. The, the likenesses are better in ISS 64, even though they're not, they haven't got the names, because yeah, you've still official. got Ravinelli, gray the Ravinelli hair. with the grey hair, you've got Alejo as Ronaldo with his, with his ball, they're not, they're not great, but FIFA 64, I don't think they even have faces. No, they're just generic coloured men, aren't they? Graphics, I think in terms of how it looks, again, FIFA, the FIFA one, probably at the time, looked, because looked, it had the big open spaces of the stadiums, it kind of looked okay, but, IS 64, it looks very, very rough around the edges, but it was colourful. Yeah. That looks all right. Yeah. Joe, you know, it looks like a decent game for its time. Yeah. That looks like turd. Yeah. It looks yeah, like someone's right. poked you in the eye. <laughs> right. Yeah. To and look, even to like look at it. the animations, again, we were <laughs> ourselves laughing at like the referee animation when he was doing his puff on his chest. At least he's got one. The FIFA 64, where it's like red car comes out and he stands there for 20 minutes. And the graphics, I suppose, when you talk about, you've got to talk about engine at some points as well. You know, when it was it was FIFA when the guy got stuck with the yeah. ball at the goalkeeper's yeah. foot, and we literally were laughing our heads and off for a few seconds. Into each other. And, but that happened so many like times during the game. Not that that type of thing, but it had a really slow engine. I was pressing pass, and a couple of seconds later, yeah. the guy would pass, and that you're like, yeah. "What's going on here?" Well, I think that comes. So I don't think there's any doubt. No. Really, ISS 64 takes it in terms of graphics. Yeah, there's a little bit of bleed over into into this point, I guess, in terms of the controls. But this is actually the toughest one because here's the thing: are the controls at fault for FIFA 64? Because ultimately, they're pretty much the same controls as 96 and probably 98, 99. Whereas it's just a terrible game. Whereas I really struggled with the controls on IS 64 because the run was in the was bottom C and. And a tackle was above it. I thought I was going to be in the minority on this one. I was going to say FIFA's got the better controls. Coming from the point of view of, it's probably the fourth time in my life I've picked up an N64 pad. <laughs> I struggled with both of them. Yeah. Not as much as you. <laughs> I no, struggled less with one than you, the other. But you're right. Once you actually said it, and I was looking at the pad too too much, and I was like, what's this yellow <laughs> weird directional button? C split into four. When you went, ah, Basically, it's just your PlayStation pad, and I realised what the tap and the run button is essentially a triangle. The, the, you transpose the old grey PlayStation BA and, the, and the and the left and down of the C buttons essentially became your four face yeah. buttons from a PlayStation pad, and the extra C buttons became your shoulder but what, yeah. you, what, what, what your shoulder buttons were on it. I just um, ignored them. That's why I. Was it like, so I, I'm gonna go for me. Controls was ISX 64, but I think it's two to one. FIFA 64 yeah. wins it because I think these are both right. Yeah, yeah, it's a shame that because again, I, I, no, 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 because. Again, it had a it had a through ball that was easily done. The controls on that were exactly the same, except there's a change camera button right on your pad, oh, which yeah. is just terrible. Yeah, that's ridiculous. So, it's got to be a draw. Okay. Yeah, I mm, think we that's it. We haven't got the counters for that. No, just put it in the middle. You. Okay. I think it's a draw just because the FIFA, 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 FIFA learned from it. Yeah. And went. Let's not have a button that changes the camera to any of our six cameras that do. We'll find out when we get to 
FIFA 90 World Cup 98, and we'll know whether that's true or not. Oh, yeah. Um, stay tuned. Yeah, stay tuned for that. Just Seven costume so, changes later. Game modes. Um, FIFA 64 had no game modes yeah, to friendly. the point where we'd set this we'd set this up and said pens are an important part. We want to do this. Let's have a pen competition. You can't access pens directly, so we had to play a game where we just Found tried to it. foul each other in the box Which so we could test enjoyable. them. It was still not enjoyable. It was horrible. It was still really it was actually difficult. Really to do. difficult. There was one point when I'm just like. Pass the ball to me, and you're like, just come and tackle me. You can tackle. You can't pass the ball like, to him. That's a point. The through ball button on IS 64's boss, the same button on FIFA 64, is hard tackle, uh, which basically is push someone to the ground and get sent off straight away. Why would you need that button? I'm not. I'm look. I'm all for having a foul button in computer games. <laughs> the way, I'm, the way I'm, he plays the game, I the way we cultured football <laughs> play. But right, don't name it hard tackle. Yeah. That's not what Name it is. Foul. That's not what it is. It's just a foul. It's There's a dive. GBH. There's a dive button on later games. Yeah. It does exactly what it says on the tip. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? You understand what you're getting yourself into when yeah. you're pressing that dive button. Absolutely. When you're playing it for the first time and it's three minutes in, you think, I'm gonna hard tackle him here. And you punch him in the back, double fisted. Yeah. That's not a hard tackle. On the modes, are we classing ridiculous camera positions and things as a as a game mode? Well, I was gonna I was gonna say because ISS sixty four is littered with Cool little bits and pieces by comparison, you know, the scenario mode. I love the scenario mode. The theory of that was really good. We were rubbish at it. Oh, we were genuinely rubbish. I genuinely at it. want modern games to, you know, there's, there's certain modes yeah. that we're going to cover in this series. And Istanbul would have been the perfect yeah. scenario. It, yeah. it, the best graphics with the new playing engine, if you had those yeah. modes, if they kept that up, yeah. I'd be made up. So, uh, without a shadow of a doubt, ISO 64 wins that. Free kicks. Um, it's pretty much going to be an easy. Yeah, the I, next couple isn't FIFA it? 64 was f-ing terrible. Yeah, put yeah. There's that the one look, the one I scored where I pointed the arrow. You put the man in front of it to block it, and it went the top other side. left. Yeah, but just to try and make it an argument, the free kick mode on um, ISS 64. The fact that you didn't know which angle you were going to get to yeah. take the free kick was frustrating. At least it existed. So three quarters of the pitch from like the, from basically once you got beyond the top edge of the penalty area. They stopped having a behind the kicker view. <clears throat> why? Why? Like, like, why? Well, who thought? No, that'll be fine. Yeah. No, that'll be fine. Yeah, like, I... We'll have it on the top of the goal in a weird bird's eye view. Yeah. No... You could change that though, which we realised later well, on. You could do it we? slightly wider, couldn't yeah. you? But you couldn't have it. But you could have it right. Behind. It's ridiculous what they've de- what they've decided to not do. Yeah. There. They've just decided to stop working. The release date's come <laughs> up and they've gone, we need to jettison something, I know what it will be. Yeah. It's flawed, but if it's a head-to-head... Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Pens. Can I do? Can I give first, first go on pens? I think that that is the best penalties ever created on a football game in ISS 64. I don't think there's a more fun, proper variation because it's all down to you. Well, you're not putting it yeah. down to the computer in any way, shape or form. It's a tactical head-to-head when you're playing at a one-on-one first and foremost. Yeah. You can really get into people's heads. You can use the fact that you can turn the radar on and off to get into You yeah. did it to me off-camera yeah. so many times by putting it in the top corner, showing me where it was, and then taking it off. And then I dive the other way, and you just put it in there. So there's something yeah, there, yeah, and, it, and not only that, but you know, as good as the cycle is, the square gets smaller, so the, the chances of them missing are a lot, a lot lower. And it's just, it's the, it's literally the greatest penalties in any yeah, computer game. I fully agree. We will play that again. FIFA 64 is fine. It's, it's standard. It's point it in a direction, press the yeah. button to shoot, or press the button to dive, and it goes in one of eight directions. Say, there's nothing wrong with it, and it, it, it works. The penalty system works. You can't. So there's nothing wrong with it. But you're right. That, it, it's it, like it, that is so good. It's like its own arcade game on its own. Commentary. It's got to be FIFA. It's got to be FIFA. I mean, you've got Des Lynham there introducing it from the studio. Apparently, you've got Andy Gray. Um, you've definitely got John Motson doing some stuff. Oh, the crowd aren't happy about that. So that red card means they're down to ten. The 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 ISS one where it, you you you. you you score a pen, it goes, oh, like he's levelled it up. And you're like, calm down, mate, it's a pen. It's, it's a turn based <laughs> system. It's going to happen. It's a turn based yeah, system. Yeah. Goal! He finished that beautifully. It's been a real walkover for Germany. So then, last one for the day fun. I wonder that, where that's going to go. wonder where that's not even, let's not mess about. FIFA 64, fun. FIFA 64. No, not for me. Oh, no, sorry. Yeah, um, I, 
I didn't have that much fun, but I put that down to not knowing the pad. Chris was genuinely as angry as I've ever seen him. Yeah. After that, he literally wasn't happy. Yeah, but you know what? FIFA 64 was like a big pile of poo. Yeah. A big, stinking, wet, sloppy pile of poo. It was shit. It was the worst thing that I've ever played, ever. And I'm getting actually angry thinking about playing the game, which is just ridiculous, because I played it like 24 hours ago. Yeah. And it, it was just goddamn pathetic. Yeah. So oh, there we geez. go. It brings up the totals. I'll give a, I've given a point each for controls, because let's not, let's not start the series off with half points. <laughs> Um, so that means it's a grand total of 6-3 ISS and the Pro Evo ISS series takes a 6-3 uh, points uh, goal difference I should say lead over over the FIFA series there which means 3 points for the win puts the ISS PES series top of the table after one play but we know you shouldn't really look at a table so early on into a season um, but there you go I don't know what you mean by top of the table and a one <laughs> <laughs> I don't know either mate Oh, and why's your phone talking to me? <laughs> yeah. the, the amount of words that we've actually said in this last 25 minutes, it took top of the table. Yeah. I there wonder you if you've said like the code word for uh, yeah. turning your phone on and start listening. Did you say microphone or something like that? And it's gone, microphone? Yes, I'll yeah. have a little bit of that. Thank you yeah, very exactly. much. Very, very interesting. There we go. And that was much more enjoyable than FIFA 64. It was. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Uh, okay, so we'll wrap that up there let us know your thoughts if you've played either of the games if you think FIFA 64 is a good game in your memory I, I, I strongly suggest I'd suggest going back to play it just because if, if you're going to disagree with us I want you to be to see why that we're right um, but other than that um, do let us know we're going we're gonna to have a vote using the poll in the corner of the screen which year do you want us to visit next as I said, we can go back through the entire history of the games from the, with the ISS days all the way through to modern day in Pro Evolution Soccer. Let us know you've got a choice of three, and that choice of three is... 1999, 2007, and 2010. Click the poll in the corner of the screen and vote, and we'll play that year of games next time on the show. If you haven't done so already, click the subscribe button, subscribe to the channel, and check back here next time for more Pro Evo versus FIFA.